Hello everybody, um, I am here with a video that I've never done before. Um, it's going to be about crafts. I am a craft fiend. I even have a whole room devoted to crafts. Um, I do a lot of scrapbooking. I have a sewing machine in there so I uh, mend stuff and tailor stuff. Um, and I've recently got into making jewelry. And I was in a smoothie shop today and I was wearing this necklace. Not not this one, but I was wearing a necklace that I made and the girl's like, oh, I really love your necklace. And so I was telling her that I made it and she's like, I'll totally buy one. And then the other girl who was like on the other side of the counter was like, yeah, I'd totally buy one too. And I'm like, okay. So um, I got down the colors that they wanted and I'm going to make a couple of them and have them pick which ones they want. So that's really exciting. And then um, not too long ago at Starbucks, I was wearing a ring that I had made, or my friend was wearing a ring that I had made, and the person at Starbucks was like, I would totally give you a free coffee if you could make me a ring like that. So that's three people, random people, who have just been like, I really like what you've done, where can I get it? So that makes me pretty happy, because, like, who doesn't want to get noticed for stuff they put, like, time and effort into? So, this is video. It's going to be um, a bit of a crafting haul because what I was doing before the smoothie shop was shopping at Hobby Lobby, which is really dangerous for me. And I have to limit myself. And I always go like between two things, like two errands I need to run so that I don't spend a lot of time there because I can spend a lot of time there. Um, just about as much time as I can spend at Michael's. And yeah, so I got some stuff. They had some good clearance. And then I'm also going to show you some of the things that I've made. Um, and then I'm going to start kind of reproducing and open up an Etsy shop and kind of go from there and see if anybody's interested in buying anything. And then if you're local, um, sorry, I keep on moving my bangs. I hate people who are constantly touching their hair and now I am one of them. Um, if you're local, then totally do like meet up somewhere and shipping is free. So yeah, when I get that Etsy shop going, I will let you know. Okay, so first we're going to start off with a couple of things that I've made. Um, I made this guy last night. It's a ring. It's a giant bow ring. The reason why I got it was because I had seen the giant bows at Michael's and then I saw them again and I was like okay I just need to buy it so I made this one and then this one I think I'm gonna paint uh, my husband gave me that idea so I love that because I don't need two giant gold rings um, so I'm gonna paint it or I'll make it exactly like this and then set it um, okay, another thing that I made recently were these earrings. And I made them out of clay that you just bake in the oven. And they've got a little... Come on, focus, focus on something. See, they've got like little edging in them. I think they're really cute. So yeah, I made those. And then this was the necklace that the girls at the smoothie shop wanted. So it's made out of like a men's chain. And then it's painted with nail polish. And I got the idea from Andrea's Choice. And um, I just love the grady, gradiated, gra gradiated? I don't know what the word is. Effect of the different colors of the turquoise into the white. And uh, yeah, so there's that. And then I like it wrapped around my wrist too. I think it's really cool to have like all the different colors kind of mix in. So that one is what the girls are getting, um, but they're getting it in different colors. So yeah, those are just some of the kind of things I've come up with lately. And then lastly, um, I made a couple of these rings. I don't have any on me because they were given away to friends. Um, but I can show you a picture if it pops up. Okay, so here we're gonna try this from the phone to the key. Yeah, okay So that is what it looks like. It's a little white button 
and it's made out of uh, wire. You can see from the side. So yeah, and I've made like four of those and they've all been taken by friends because they love them. So that is the crafting that I have done um, lately. And yeah, I'll let you know about the Etsy shop for sure. So some things you may see in the Etsy shop soon would be some of these things that I got at Hobby Lobby today. Okay, not that, not that. Okay, so first thing I picked up was some necklace chain. This is just uh, six yards of fine cable chain. So that is a lot of necklaces right there. Um, to go along with that, I got some more of these little claspy guys that you use. Um, they're oval jump rings. And you use these to, oh, there's crows flying around like crazy, um, to hook on like, uh, like fasteners and stuff. So yeah. I picked up some more clay. So this is the clay that I use. Well, I happened to get this one because it was a super good sale. And this is called, mm -hmm, I don't know, it's called Get the Out of the Way Tag. Cern it. It's called Cern it. I don't know what that is. It's the brand. You bake it in the oven. Yeah, and it's kind of like a fuchsia color. So, hey, it matches my lips. Okay. I picked up some more wire. This is 22 gauge. This is the size I like to use for my button rings in silver. I use a lot of those. I picked up some beads. These are just glass beads. A plain glass mix assorted selection for you. And that's them right there. And then a bunch of random doodads from the clearance section. So I picked up a P for my niece Penelope. I'll either make her something with it or I'll wear something with the P on it. And they do like a little heart with the P. That would be cute. I picked up this little box claspy guy. And then it's kind of indented on this side. So I'm thinking I'm going to take something like this and do like a something like this inside shape sort of thingy. I don't know. We'll see. Um, oh, I got this owl. I forgot about him. He's cute. Do, do, do. Owl. I don't know if it's going to focus. Mwah. It's got a really thick like interior. It was the first one that came in my head. Um, yeah, so I may stick this on like a leather bracelet with just like the one charm. I think that would be really cute. And lastly, from Hobby Lobby were these beads. They came in a set of three. I just really loved this combination. Um, and I think I may just do it on one necklace. Maybe do like a silver bead between each one. And then just have it kind of dangle low. I don't know. I really thought those were pretty. So I'll say that at Hobby Lobby. And then yesterday I picked up this at Michael's just a little closure with a bow. So cute! And I also got this cool guy. Uh, another closure. Boop. And I was thinking of putting this onto a clutch bag. Making a bag and then doing that to close it. So, ah! The bag may not stay closed. But it'll look cute. Can't put anything inside of it. So, that is it for this crafting extravaganza video. Um, let me know of any of the little crafty things I already did, if you like any of them. Um, that way I know like which ones to reproduce more of. And then, yeah, I will let you know about my Etsy shop whenever that happens. I'm assuming it's easy to start. It's anything online is easy. Um, and let me know if you like these crafting videos, because I love crafting. And if you enjoy it, and I enjoy it, that sounds like a good time. I'll talk to you later. Bye.